guys, I have a cup of coffee with me. Let me have a taste. Mmm, this is by far one of the best coffee I have had in a long time. Are you interested in joining me? <laughs> Guys, just tell me that you didn't feel that video that you just watched right now. Big lie. What if I tell you that I didn't create that image from scratch before I turned this into a video? Yes, you heard me right. That particular animated character you just watched right now is me. This is the image before and this is the image after. And I did that in less than 5 minutes before turning it into an animated video with just my phone. Yes, my smartphone. And you can also do it too. Just watch this particular video to the end and thank me later. Let's dive right into it. Guys, so the first place we are going to go to is our Chrome browser. We are going to click on a new page because we don't want to use the old page and just type on chat GPT. Do not use chat GPT app. Please use the one on your Chrome browser because the app gets tired like almost immediately and we don't want anything that will start giving us gibberish like wrong thing. We want everything to be accurate. We are on chat GPT now and we have a fresh page. So because we are not creating our image from scratch, we are going to click on the plus sign that's where we would have the options of uploading our image so when you go ahead and click on the plus sign you see take photo you can take a fresh picture but we are using a picture we already have on our image or our gallery so you tap on add photos and go to photo library or choose files if you have it in your documents so we will go ahead and tap on photo library and search for the picture that we want to use now we will select our beautiful picture and go ahead to upload it right on chat gpt it's going to take a few seconds to process but you know just upload it it won't even take time at all the next thing to do is to click on this box right here where your picture is and go ahead to tell chat gpt exactly what you want it to do with this picture for you if you just want to change the background of the picture tell chat gpt please change the background of this picture to yellow or blue or whatever it is you want to do so we are turning this our image to a pixel um 3d style image and if you so wish you can go ahead and copy the prompt in case you do not want to stress yourself or you are planning on creating something similar to what i am doing right now so we are going to ask chat gpt to turn this image into a 3d style animated image adjust a posture maintain afro hair style skin color face and floral jackets change the background to make it look like she's in a youtube studio guys be specific with what exactly you want if you want chat gpt to change the dress your your image is wearing it will do it perfectly well for you you know so we told it to change the background to make it look like she's in a youtube studio um we asked chat gpt to also put a wall frame of this exact picture behind her hmm. you guys are actually underestimating the power of ai you are underestimating what these free um applications can do for you these free platforms what they can do for you if you know how to use these things trust me you are going to be earning far more than what you can actually imagine what you think if people are truly earning it or not but that's not why we are here so after you've gone ahead to um tell chat gpt what exactly you want well detailed you can actually do a voice note telling chat gpt to do what you want explaining to it using a voice note or you type it so i typed it because i want chat gpt to mm. define my prompt for me please do not forget to tell it to give you the image in 16 ratio 9 aspect ratio because that's what youtube uses this is our modified prompt and i will advise you screenshot this Turn this portrait into a pixel style 3D animated character while keeping her afro hair style, natural skin tone, facial features. See guys, always tell chat GPT to put in like to retain your facial features because of course you want to always have consistent looking images and you don't want your images to be looking different all the time. So for you to always have consistent images, you need to try and use your own personal picture. After all, nobody will know it is you. Anyway, just take a look at the 
prompt and screenshot it like i said so that you can use it for yourself you just tweak a little things you just change one or two things and you are good to go also remember that the output should be in 16 ratio 9 aspects ratio now we'll go ahead and ask chat gpt to generate this pixel style animated image and here we go it will just take a few minutes and your picture will be ready Ah, this looks so fine so let's go ahead and save it save your image to your phone you can save it to your files your documents or wherever just save this image so this is what we have now and i went ahead to tell chat gpt to generate another picture another one of this particular picture just um that i wanted it to hold a coffee cup up. so i told this oh generate this picture again but this time around make it hold a coffee cup and i told um chat gpt that i want a yellow coffee cup here we go guys our picture is 98 percent ready and this is our image with a yellow coffee cup i love it i love 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 it so much now we are going on to the next phase where we are going to turn this particular image into a proper video let's go guys so to animate our image we are going to go back to chrome and open a new page and type on digin ai yes that is what we would be using to turn our image into video this is completely free so you tap on digin ai and you will be asked to sign up with your email trust me i have a series um, of emails so i use just one of them use any email it, do it does not have to be an active email or something that you know you have to always use just create an email and use it to sign up in um digin ai did you notice that before we signed up we had zero credits but immediately we signed up using an email we had 300 credits and these 300 credits is what you'll be using to create your videos each video costs i think 20 credits which is superb so with 300 credits you can create more than 20 videos all these videos you are seeing here were created using this particular app so if you have 300 credits trust me you can create any of these videos you can see here so we are going to go ahead and animate our um, image that we just created using chat gpt so you are just going to tap on the create button or the create sign there once you tap on the create sign it is going to bring us directly onto our workspace so i call this a workspace because this is where you are going to be making all the magic happen as you can see we have our prompt we have talk where you can generate your video and make it talk or make it do as if it's talking yeah so that's what we are going to do right now so the next phase now is to tap on this image sign and upload your image the particular image you want to change or turn into a video is what you should upload on this image sign so once you tap it you go to your photo library and upload this our image that we just created using chat gpt don't worry guys it doesn't even take long to upload in few seconds and your picture is right on the workspace you can as well tap on the aspect ratio in case you want to change it but i decided to leave it at what it was initially 16 9 because the 16 ratio 9 on here looks different and it was going to crop my picture too much the next phase now is to tap on talk which means we are going to give our video this talking effect like add a lip motion to our video so you are going to tap on talk and then tap on a voice just tap on it not like we even need the voice actually because we are going to use another app to give it a voice next is to tap on prompt and then go ahead and tell it what you want the video to do so we are going to put um, make my character talk and make natural and realistic gestures gestures meaning you want your character to wave their hands shake their head and stuff like that so once you are done with that it's going to generate in 720p because if you want 1080p it has to be the pro version and you may need to pay money and these things do not even come in cheap so we are even thankful that they allow us to create for free for um 720p so now our video is generating once you are done with
with the prompt just go ahead and tap on generate video it's not even going to take long at all before you say jack robinson your video is ready once your video is ready just go ahead and save the video directly to your phone then we are going to go into the next phase to create this video or to animate your video you just need 20 units so if you want to animate 10 videos you multiply it 10 times 20 how many does that give you 200 so to um, animate 20 videos you need 200 units now i came back to daijin ai to animate my um image that has the coffee cup so for this image i use the prompt make my character talk while making hand gestures you know with one hand and holding the coffee cup with the other hand you know just tell it whatever you want the same way you instructed chat gpt to um animate your image for you is the same way you are going to tell daijin ai to turn this your image to a video so let's see what it gives us with this image that has a coffee cup guys please copy this prompt if you have the same kind of image so we'll go ahead and generate our video now and here's our our video with the coffee cup what do you think about it let me know in the comment section as for me personally i so much love it like i love 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 these images and even the quality that it gives for 720p is superb so let's go ahead now and add a voiceover to our video we are going to be using dream face for this particular one and it is the last stage of this video and we'll call it a day so guys this is dream face looking all beautiful and colorful and on this platform we can actually make our character talk we can turn our image to video and you know also do so much more so go ahead and tap on the plus sign here and when you tap on the plus sign it will ask for permission to access all your photos and your videos you give it permission pick the particular video that short video we just animated using daijin ai we are going to select it and ask dream face to um, make our video talk or sing now there are different ways to actually go about this you can actually type in what you want your image to say or you can record it here on dream face or you import the audio so for me i already did a pre-recorded um voiceover so i recorded it and i saved it here on my app so i just went ahead to pick the recorded voiceover or the voice note that i did on my phone and i imported it on dream face for animated video dream face is actually um unlimited exactly that's the word unlimited and it only animates 30 seconds of your video so if you have a 10 minute voiceover or voice recording you have to animate it 30 seconds each after importing your audio go ahead and pick a voice for me i will be using my original voice to do the um voiceover i didn't use any of their voices on dream face i used my original voice so once you are done you know what to do just go ahead and tap on animate and it's going to animate your video for you so it may take a while for your video to be ready let's say max two minutes in fact two minutes is too much but your video is going to be ready in no time and guys this is our end product i'm going to play it for you right now if you are looking to start your folktale channel then this is one of the best platform for you anyway to say thank you to premier elevate all you need to do is to like this video and subscribe to our channel because she's going to be bringing lots and lots of value to you bye guys and i hope you love this video Thank you guys so much for watching. If you have any questions, leave it in the comment section and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!